word I'm coming through.
Is it time for us to be back? I think it is. I think oh. it is back o'clock. All right. I think we should come back then. All right. So you saw me click in there and it became nighttime suddenly. Um, welcome back, everybody. Uh, we're going to continue our Pokemon Crystal Nuzlocke here. Uh, but I said a funny word there. Ian, 
What's a Nuzlocke? Well, it's, you see, it's when you take a uh, padlock and you, yeah. and you nuzzle it real close. Just, just real, real up on your cheek. Just real up in there. Well, you see, Ian, that's wrong. Oh. Well, shit. <laughs> so, Ian, tell me, what is a Nuzlocke? Well, you see, a Nuzlocke is a way to challenge yourself when yep. you play Pokemon. So one way that we do it, the first rule, some might say, is yeah. that uh, you can only catch the first Pokemon you encounter in an area. That's correct, Ian. Rusty, can you tell me the second rule of the Nuzlocke? Yeah. That's okay, I don't even pay attention to Ian when he speaks anyway. God damn, is it true? First thing you see. Yeah. Yep. Well, you see, Rusty, that's wrong. If the Pokemon faints, it's dead, and you can't use it anymore. So, uh, yeah, we're doing that. Yep. Um, you may have noticed that my Butterfree used Powder Snow there, which it can't normally use, um, but due to how the randomizer is handling TM compatibility, it can now. Yep. So it's real nice. So, uh, the other rule that we'll be using is that uh, we must nickname all of our Pokemon. As yep. you see our Eevee, his name is Flump. We are flumping into the Cyndaquil. Alright. So yeah, welcome back everybody. Yeah. We're gonna go through the underground here and try and beat some trainers. Uh, the idea is I want to get strong enough to take on Whitney. Uh, you can see our stream beast here. This is the cat. And uh, she likes to be involved. She likes to be involved? Yes. Until you want to give her affection? Yeah. And then uh, she's not about that life. Yeah. So uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fight the trainers here in the underground. So he's doing a veteran move. Yep. Because boy howdy do I about half the time just forget that the underground's here. Yeah. And so, uh... No, I'm a bet. Yeah. yeah. I set it to Wednesday, so I don't think I did. If I remember correctly. Oh, well. We'll come back and do it. I think I can get each other out. Oh. Die. It's not busted, but I think it's real good. Well, it's... it's an, One, it's a nice type move, so... Just having a nice type move early is really nice. It's nice. Um, it's not something you see very, very often. And it's got the special attack to use it, so... It is certainly... We will certainly try. Let's get over here. Welcome home. You have a stream, Mom. Hi, you can see her hand there. Mm -hmm. um, I'll certainly try. You guys should be able to hear her rusty now. Yeah. All right. Ew. Let's take Perhaps a look. If I click back in oh, you're fighting the Elite Four member, yeah. Rachel. I, we got here a lot earlier than I thought we would. Oh, no. Stream's almost over. Yeah. You know, that Elite Four. Right. Actually, yeah. Yeah. 
though. Now, which move do you use here? What super effective move do you use here, oh, Nathan? There's so many options. Uh... None of them get stabbed. Yeah. Does Powder yeah. Snow do more damage than Confusion? They should theoretically do the same. Okay. Uh, Powder Snow has a slight chance of freezing. Uh, Confusion has a slight chance of confusing. Both will Oko, so the real factor is PP. Yeah. Roast. Um, let's see what this guy does. Hey, welcome to Pokemon Salon. I'm younger and less expensive. He's not a vet. He, has, he doesn't have the years invested yet to charge more. I'm gonna more. give Flump a haircut. Uh, I liked your uh, Tim Allen sound there. It's too bad we can't go camping and give him some curry. It's too bad. I, I get it. I get the joke. Hey, look, a coin case. And I'm gonna fight a guy. Guy. Yep, the guy is Gymnast Pie. I love it. Ooh, dragon. I know how to fight this. You can slay that dragon. Chill yes. Like your army impression. Thank you. Got my dragon oh, it is a dragon air, so it's got a little bit of defense. It's, it's got some beef to it. Or Special defense. That's okay. Still doesn't like to chill out. What killed the dragons? The Ice Age! Hey, you have level. Good. I'm glad. Well, you were talking about Butterfree not getting a stab move. Yeah, that's kind of how, how Butterfree goes until Bug Buzz exists. Well, yeah, in this generation, Butterfree's stab move is going to be Gus. Yeah, no, he, he just does not do his stab moves very well. Yeah, don't happen. He gets way, way better in later generations, though. Well, yeah. there's like six Bug moves right now. Yeah. And most of them don't do damage. Right. You, you've yeah, got String life. Shot. You've got Fury Cutter. Yep. You've got... Leech Life, like Nathan said. Leech Life. Okay. Is it just three? Um, Mega Horn. Mega Horn. Only on Heracross right now. Yep. Right. Uh, Pin Missile also exists. Which has like four Pokemon it's on and one of them's an electric type. Yep. Hey man, uh Pin Missile Jolteon was the way to kill Sabrina back in the day. It certainly is the bug move of general. Yeah. What I'm saying is if you were struggling with Sabrina, Pin Missile on your Jolteon yeah. took care of it real quick. Pin Pistol on your Jolteon was a way to do it. If not, you could just brute force it. Yeah. Alakazam does not have a physical defense. You just need something that'll survive. One hit. Yep. Honestly, most of the time I've fought Sabrina, I haven't... I mean... Yes, I, I'll typically like have a dark type, but honestly, most of the time I just hit the yellow because I am really hard with a physical move, and we're good to go. Say that like it's a bad thing. No, no, it's not a bad thing. I'm using your own sandstorm against you. And a true statement. You killed it with a rock. I did. This little fire dog. Yep. Threw a rock at it. So, Ian, yeah. you're taking a stroll through, like, a little little underground pathway, mm -hmm. and uh, some Pokemon trainer walks up and murders your dog with a rock snake. 
What do you do? Literally murder him. Like... Yeah, that's cans. No, like... You don't understand how much I love dogs. Yeah. Like... This is the kid who went bawling at every uh, Sarah McLaughlin commercial. Listen! Are you kidding me? Yeah. Those commercials are awful. I hate them. I'm just gonna shove the camera in these adorable animals' faces and not help them? I couldn't do it. It's not me. So I can buy <gasps> Poppet, Paris, or Chikorita. Nathan? Yeah? There's a correct answer there. Yeah. I, I, under I agree. Hoppit was real cheap. Uh, <laughs> no idea what any of these are. Paris has the 100% put him to sleep move with Spore. It does. Yes, that that is the good thing it does. Yeah. yeah, in this generation, they don't even tell you what the TMs are. So you're just you're buying them blind. Truly blind in this one, because I have no idea what those are. There's no way to look them up. Nope. nope. But technically, uh, we do have a spoiler log that we could check. I'm not gonna. You would generate the spoiler log? I don't know if I did or didn't. I never do. Three coins. We'll do a, a, a game just to... Nathan, you need actual coins. Yeah. Give money. Oh, by the way, I hate. Yeah, well, we'll kind of show it off. I'm gonna bet three coins. I'm gonna go Badoop, and I'm gonna go Badoop, and I'm gonna go Badoop. No. Nope. And I lose. You just lost all. Hey, since we're definitely using a real Game Boy. Yeah. And not an emulator. Yeah. We couldn't, like, slow down the turbo, could we? Oh, yeah, I could totally do that on my really real Game Boy. It's so real. You don't understand how real it is. Yep. Yeah, we can go down to, like, 1% on our Nintendo your Game Boy. Yep. Your Canadian Game Boy. Yeah. <laughs> it's a real Game Boy. Eh. It just lives in Canada. And I'm not going to go into the gym. I'm going to go into this house. See what this fat guy says. Oh, it tells me about PP. <laughs> PP. Gross. I'm glad that that man told you about his PP. Yep. Go down here. Last time a fat man told me about his PP, he ended up in prison. I get it. I'm going to talk to this guard. <sighs> oh, what's this? He wants me to do him a favor. He wants to give me a Pokemon. What mail? Well, he I better wants make room to. for it. And I'm oh, gonna this say, is also going to be random, isn't it? It should be. Yep. Um, I'm going to say that's my Goldenrod catch. Does that mean that you yeah. get one from... The game corner? Uh, yes. Um, We're definitely not going to farm out that Chikorita, Ian. No, that's that's fair. I'm going to deposit... The correct answer is deposit whoever's last in your party. So that, uh... So that it's easier to switch back and forth. But, uh, They're all the same level. Um... The reason I deposited Murp is because he wasn't Barbara or uh, Flump. Yeah, we do want them to like us. Hey, kid, can you do me a favor? Yeah. So this is normally a Spiro named Spiro? Kenya. I knew it was a Spiro. One time, Dragonite. Let's take a look and see what it is now. Kenya. A... Is a side up. No. Still a bird. Bird. Well, I'm gonna go deposit Ken. 
You know what I'm is the, is I think we already had a side eye. Is it still holding a It is mail? still holding a flower mail. Okay. I just didn't know how that would work. I didn't know if that would have been randomized or not. Because yeah. I don't think you randomized held items. I was taking a chance that that was going to be something more impressive than... Oh, you can't let me remove a man, aren't you? Okay. Can you not deposit them with mail? No. I straight do not remember that. There. All right. Can I deposit Kenya? Um, it was either that or grind something for uh, the game corner or uh, wait for Bill to come over and get whatever the EV is. I'm gonna get my Merp! Yeah, I get it. Okay. No, mostly I just wanted to see what it was. And Zadok's not horrible. Yeah. It is a third water type. I think we already had a Psyduck. Yeah, but... We had a Staryu. Yeah. We've got a, a Golding, a Staryu, and a Psyduck. I think we've got two Psyducks. So it may now. be a fourth water type. If we've got two Psyducks, it's a fourth water type. Yep. Well, having a water type... What I'm saying is, we're leaning heavy water, which makes sense because it's the most plentiful type in the game. That normal. I think actually at this point, Poison was the most plentiful. Well, that's because every grass type is poison, for, with, like, four exceptions right now. Yeah. I know definitely in Gen 1, the most common type was poison type. Well, that's because you have two types, effectively. Yeah. Defeated Swimmer Dudley. Not the name I would have associated. Nor Swimmer, nor Dudley. It was a female swimmer. Hey, this... I've got a girlfriend. Go away, nerd. Isn't there a snubble on this route normally? Uh, I don't remember this, this route or the route south of it. There is a snubble uh, that is in the um, uh, bug catching zone. Maybe that's what I'm thinking. Scary face. Bonk. Bonk. Press you can give what's her face your phone number and she'll call you back and have you fight her snubble all the time. Yeah, that checks out. Rat. Rat I, I liked his little butt shake there. He kind of kind of shakes his ass. Like he's ready to pounce. He's rat. He is in fact a rat. He's ready for something. Calm down. Also, that's level 15. Yeah. That was a crit after a tailor. Yeah. I think deserves a good press. Yeah, I'm gonna go heal my flump. Which is not a euphemism, kids. Biker Thomas wants to fight me. Straight door. Do not remember which one that one was. Biker Tom Thomas is normally Hiker Anthony. Okay. I know. The, I know who Hiker yeah. Anthony is. He's right outside uh, the cave. Union Cave. It's weird to think about a game for children where they set up a system that your friends in the game call you in order to fight you. Yeah. What's up? Want to fight? No, 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 no. You want to fight, though. <laughs> I mean, 
if, if Pokemon were real, I would definitely hit up my bros and fight them all the time. I we sure have am. fought like 70 Larvitars. I will admit they are starting to get pretty common. <laughs> we still don't have a good answer for them. No, nothing great. Your best is to just drop his defense and throw it. I just gotta be beefy. She does just kind of say that her boyfriend is not worth it. Alexis. What are you saying, Alexis? <laughs> <laughs> that is a quote. She is quoting here. Yes, I know. Gotta squeeze a larvitar. Nathan, you can't do that on stream! Gotta throw a rock at it. Crick the pit. Much, much, much. Much, 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 much. Kill it. Kill it. Squeeze it. Kill it. No. Uh, Literally one HP. Bonk. Bonk. Now it's dead. Chloe. Oh, Chloe. Maybe. Man, he was dead on you there. Yeah, he was kind of gunning for me. Yeah. Spinners are fun. I'm gonna fight them all. And I would too. Two compete. We fought a fair number of Togepi's as well. Yeah. He's gonna charm my flump. Well, that's that's because we're early game, and Tokapi just does not have a high base stat total, so we're more common to roll a Tokapi than we are, you know, a Snorlax right now. That's true. Yeah. Which is kind of a blessing from the uh, keeping stuff the same around the same level or around the same power, I guess. Because that's one of the options that we selected for this randomizer. Yeah. Is that uh, we keeping things around the same uh, level. So, once we get later on in the game, we'll probably actually start branching out and see these, you know, Alakazams and whatever else. Yeah. Slugma. Seen a couple of him, too. Yeah. Well, and this is Gen 2. Um, the pool of Pokemon that things can be swapped for is substantially smaller. Yeah. I will say, I am used to doing Gen 3 and up, so... There's at least, you know, 100 plus more Pokemon in that. Yeah. How many ever ended up getting introduced. Ugh. And don't burn. Good. So what do you think our uh, mill tank is going to be? Uh, it's a good question. Yeah, Dan, um, it's, it feels like he's a Gen 3 Pokemon Slugma. It just feels like it to me. Yeah. Well, Slugma is a Pokemon in Hoenn. Um, you even fight one in the gym battle with Flannery, Flannery at least one. I'm gonna talk to this guy. This is normally the uh, fire ring. Yep. If I recall, you don't really get a good option to catch a Slugma until very, very late in the Gen 2 games. Like, when you go back to uh, Cinnabar. Yeah, Cinnabar. I don't want to say it's on Cycling Road, but that's so, still Kanto. Cinnabar and, and so. Mad Cargos are on Cycling Road, yeah. yeah. So we got a Venomoth Oh, here. you are going to heck up this moth. Yeah. yeah. So it is kind of cool. This that is pretty got realistic. Yeah. Like, if you, if you imagine a moth fluttering around and then getting hit in the head with a boulder, you yeah, don't it, imagine it that moth's yeah. going to survive. Dugong. I don't want to be murdered for that. <laughs> um, so it is kind of cool that we're seeing this, because he normally has uh, a magma. A magma. So we're getting to see a little little higher base that total and see 
some cooler Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what's our pseudo Wudo gonna be? That is the question. And are we able to avoid the grass so that that's our catch? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we can do that. Are you allowed to cheese it with repels? We can cheese it with well, repels. Or you, you don't even have to enter the grass on that route. Yeah. Uh, you we're don't on have technically to. the route before. The other thing is, uh, we can go and we can cut the grass. Because cut yep. does actually cut grass in this gen. Yep. So we can do that. I recall really this. I guess I'll have to teach cut to something. Probably. That's... I don't know if I have anything that can know it. I'm sure there's something in there that we can go... Uh, yeah, I just have to use a cut slate. Um, but I don't think I have anything on my team. We'll see. But yeah. And there falls Entrepreneur Zoe. I bet Ponita can do it. Lil Nas. Well, hopefully we'll be able just to... Just like cutting it. a mixtape. Got it. Hmm. Okay. That was the thing you said. It is. It was a smart thing. I stand by it. Hmm. At least someone does. Juggler. This guy wants us to notice his, and I'm quoting here, bald dexterity. Oh, servant Tia. You kidder. Oh, a kid. Nice. I love me a kid. And the servant keeps talking about his bald dexterity. It's dreadful. <laughs> Just dreadful. Um, so, Dan, uh, the reason we have it right now, night right now, if we talk, uh, is because we do actually want to evolve Eevee. We are trying to evolve Eevee into Umbre. That's what we're trying to do. If it'll ever decide it, well, it loves me. Evolve we did give two. it a haircut a minute ago. Yeah. Listen, love is a hard thing to attain. I mean, I got a nice haircut. Okay, you can't just give it a haircut and expect it to love you for it. Yeah. You should give it a held item, though. Does it? Is it holding something currently? I don't think so. I think the only one... I think it's... having it hold anything is better than nothing for friendship. Possibly. Give it some mail, Nathan. I was just going to give it a berry. Yeah, that too. We do have those. And we go all over that side up. When I was a kid, I was convinced Golduck was also a psychic type. Because why would he not be? Right? Yeah. Psy Psyduck literally has Psy in the name. Is Psyduck part psychic? No. no. They're just straight water type. Oh no, it's a grass slash flying type. Oh no, <laughs> it's a grass slash flying type. Oh no, it's a dead type. Yeah, yeah. it's a dead type. Now it's a ghost type. <laughs> that is not how that works. Nintendo specifically said, no, that's not how this works. Oh, hey, mom. spoilers for uh, Sword and Shield. Continue. There's at least one Pokemon that that is how that works. Okay. We're good now. You're good. We're... Yes, Alexa, he does have psychic powers, but he's not a psychic type because Game Freak says no. Yep. I'm gonna fight the police. Like, literally his thing is that he gets headaches for his psychic powers, and if it goes insane, you know, can really hurt people. But nope, not a psychic type. Ooh, Kabuto. Kabuto. You're gonna... I'm trying to confuse it. I'm gonna go all over my liquids. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna drink this fish. Yep. We're gonna drink a fish. Yep. 
so, uh, Rusty, if you heard the phrase, like, reading an article or something, that Betty White went, and I'm quoting here, supersonic, what do you think had happened? <laughs> Uh, I'm he does thinking. Not know a rock type move. I doubt it. I... Um, I'm more concerned about it knowing a water type move. Um, which sure I don't it think it does, um, but I don't want it absorbing merp. Uh, so it is. You just hardening it. It is so awful. Yeah, to, it's not great. to have Kabuto. I love that you gave me him in that run, but he is so bad. Yeah, he doesn't start off great. I'm just gonna stay as Betty White. Betty White's a... You are Betty literally White. ten levels over, so... I am not ten levels over, I am five levels over. Oh, I, I thought I saw me level nine there first. Second. Okay. Just to to answer your question, Nathan, I'm thinking Betty White went to a racetrack and rented a car. Yeah. Or uh, had some kind of commercial where she uh, drove a, a literal race car. Yeah. Or something. It knows Scratch, Harden, and Exult. It learns Leer at level 19. It does not get a water move naturally through its level 1. Hey. Is this our police? Whoop, 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 whoop. Yep. Uh, technically, this is Analyst Pansy. Right. And I'm going to make this letter flat. Right, because it doesn't know a fire-type move anymore, Nathan. Yep. Hey, Nate, why does it not know a fire-type move anymore? Uh, the continuous march of technology. Hmm. Really? Yes. Twice in a row. Yep. Well... Yeah. Die mad about it. <laughs> I will. When I die in 200 years, <laughs> with my lifespan artificially increased, with with as you said the ineligible mark of technology, um, I will still be angry. <laughs> we uh turn to each other in our. Uh homeostasis pods and uh, you give me uh, some uh, sauce for that one time I deleted that ponytail's move I am going yeah to I'm gonna turn to you and yeah. be like god you suck at menuing <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll die with his dying gasp uh, this is our catch <laughs> fruit oh not bad no there's worse I'm gonna put it. Definitely interesting. Dan absolutely loves dive mad about it. I don't know if I can actually say that. They may actually constitute that as a threat. I don't think it's a threat. Yeah. I saw one like thing where a guy got like suspended over terms of service because he used die as like the Dutch article. Like, it's like the Dutch word for the. Yeah. Or German or whatever. It put me to sleep. No, that's the opposite of what I wanted to happen. It doesn't even have trace. This is a solution. It does not even have trace. I'm mad that I'm going to have to swap. I'm gonna sing to it. <laughs> oh, come on. I knew it was uh, gonna happen. I knew. Sing. There we go. It was one of those things that you just knew was gonna happen. This execute may be a little bit out of our league, my dude. Now, I'm gonna beat it. He could literally have used an item. This is this is on him. Don't 
Don't let the don't let him get away with this. Now I'm gonna catch him. I might say <laughs> switch out of a Barbara though. Got it. Can you do it? Okay. You say no way to go. Oh come uh, on. Why no great ball? Because I didn't want to use my one great ball. You have three. Go the F to sleep. Put him to sleep! If this one doesn't catch, I will use that great ball. But I won't be happy about it. Hey, Nate. You might, uh, use that great ball. Okay, fine. Exit gamers. This one's blue flavored. There we go. Yay! Thirty-two percent chance with a Pokeball. Forty-six with a Great Ball. That's what Dan's saying. All right. All right. All right, chat. We need a name. Think of a name. Give a name to execute. Male execute. We need a name. Give name. Give, Give name. name. Chat, you got a name? Dan, name my eggs. Yeah, Dan. Name his eggs. Name my eggs. All of my ideas are tasteless. And that is Go with that exactly idea. Exactly what we want. You are on it. Just give it. Give egg. Do it. Do it. You saying your ideas are tasteless and obscenities? Yes. That's my favorite flavor of obscenity. <laughs> You can do it, Dan. I believe in you. He's he's not not like saying this is an empty threat. This guy actually named a bunch of my Pokemon in college, and a lot of them those names aren't suitable for repeating on stream. So much pressure, I can only think of literal swear words. I think his name is literal swear word. Eh, maybe a little long. Um, what if uh named him Benedict? Ah, I get it. I'm gonna name him Swear Word. <laughs> I love it. Oh, enough! Just enough! Alright, we got Swear Word. Swear Word. I mean, we're not gonna use him, but I love it. Never say never. <laughs> Yeah. I will say, if we do use it, uh, we won't be able to evolve it until we get to Kanto. That's fine. <laughs> He's so grateful. Hard, hard, hard. Let me down. Yeah, but uh, the uh, first gems are like, or the first Elite Four are like level 40 or something. They are kind of diet Elite Four. For your first you time around. Get this which I like. Yeah. I love the pacing and design of this generation of games more than any other. It's real good. It's really good. And it was done at a time where they didn't quite have a whole lot of experience doing it. They did really well with it. I've always wondered why they didn't go back to this uh, smashing two generations together with uh, two set like to be fair I don't know if it says he didn't get away with oh there's an entire region over there just don't look over there to the right yeah I think it would be right but with 
more uh thank you dan i agree um with the with the technology that we've got you could have like teleportation or you know take a boat over in the middle of the game for different parts of it there's a lot of cool things you could do with two continents existing yeah um i will say we literally did go to space in omega ruby alpha sapphire i mean like we rode a dragon but... to space I mean, we didn't go to space. We rode a dragon into space. When you say we literally went to space, it sounds like we landed on the moon and had a little bit of a... Oh, that would have been fun. Yeah. And had a little bit of a romp on the moon. To be fair, which we is didn't not even have a water type. In, yeah. uh, in Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, we went closer to space by going to alternate dimensions. Yep. No, oh, that's definitely in space. In Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, you, you go literally thousands of light years away. That's, yep. that's, space. that's not space. That's canonically ultra space. The word space is It's it. different. <laughs> to be fair. Canonically, it's not space. It's ultra space. Sure. I have not actually played Ultra, Ultra Sun or Ultra Moon. I've only played uh, Moon. But, yeah. Really, Ian? Okay, I didn't go out and buy it. Okay, we we just. I just didn't know copy. that. Do you want to borrow it? I was just gonna wait till Nathan gets done with his copy of Ultra Ultra and Moon, and I'll play it. It's okay. It's just that's Nathan's main game right now. And, yeah. And I was. I'm patient enough to wait. Well, and the other thing is, if it is true that you can't move stuff from Gen 7 to Gen 8, then it's going to stay my main game. In that case, there... I might talk to you about borrowing it for us, Steve, yeah. but we'll see. Okay. Well, do, you, also... do you care about spoilers on this at this point, Nathan? On Specifically the, the generation thing? Um, only from the not not so much like how Pokemon bank compatibility is gonna work because that's never really set in stone until it actually happens. It is though they've they've come out pretty strong on exactly what they're planning, eh. you and they've quashed. Do you, do you want do you want to go into this conversation? Uh, we'll save it for the end of uh uh. The shield playthrough. Okay. Sword playthrough. So okay, playthrough. so ten weeks from now we'll have this conversation. Or whenever it happens. But I'm not too worried about it. Anyway. So you tell me Betty White was going supersonic? Just like reading that article. Yeah. I might assume that Betty White like goes Super Saiyan and you know flies up to beat uh, Frieza or whatever. That she can do it. That might be what would come to mind there for me. I'm gonna fight this not Burkeeper. Uh. <laughs> I don't know if I can answer that question. What is it with this room? This guy over here, he's bragging about his ball dexterity. This guy comes up and says, hey, what kind of balls do you use? Nathan, they're just really interested in your balls. Yeah. Oh, I should use pepper. I was kind of wondering. No, I was just mashing up. That's never going to be a guy to come up next. He's, next guy's going to come up and be like, I bet my bones are bigger than yours. Thank you for that. Thanks. Thanks, Rusty. Guys, I'm not going to lie. Did you know what's stuck in my head right now? What? Seeing Betty White go Super Saiyan. She can do it. She chooses not to. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's stuck in my head right now? Hmm. The song Big Balls by ACDC. I knew you were going to say that. Yeah. 
It's also the song I haven't heard in about 10 years. Right? It's been a minute. <gasps> Dude, this isn't Dude. even the one I haircut. Ho 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 ho. Oh, we got Puff. Get that Puff. Get that Puff. Speaking of balls, look at his roundness. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful segue, Rusty. All right. We got a puff. Let's look at that puff. Uh, such like, a good puff. I like how we puffed out his cheeks there. Yeah, he's got cute little cheeks. Little, little cheeks. Little cheekies. Let's, let's learn That's how to puff. That's gotta mean Evie's close behind. Evie's gotta be so. there. Although we've had, uh, we've had Barbara Longer. at the front of the line for a while. I don't think placement in the party actually affects it. It rolls its cute eyes mm. as it sings a soothing lullaby. It's a gentle song puts anyone who hears it to sleep. Put him to sleep! Um, just in case it matters, and I'm not 100% sure it does, I'm gonna give him a berry. Berry! Yeah, the early generations were not good about explaining those mechanics. Yeah, Actually, up until the last two games, really, they haven't been good about explaining those mechanics. TM04 is Vine Whip. Who can do it? Uh, Barbara! Okay, I kind of want Barbara to know Vine Whip, but that's okay. We don't really need the coverage right now. Yeah. Well... It would help, like, calm these Larvitars we keep getting. Why not? The yeah, you save all Marvel. your TMs till the till the late game, but Vine Whip is not an Elite Four move. It's not fantastic. You save your Thunderbolts for the last fights. Um, let's get rid of... I would say Charm. Uh, I, I feel like you'll get more usage out of I, Sweet Kiss. I don't like you hovering the cursor over Pound and Sing. Yeah. But it Sing made me is twitch actually every time not, you did it. Yeah, Sing is not actually super duper useful right now. Um, especially since I've got a Butterfree that no sleep powder. Um, Sweet Kiss, I was actually kind of hovering over too, because uh, Betty White knows Supersonic. Yes, but Sweet Kiss is way more accurate than Supersonic, one, yeah. and having two Pokemon that know Confusion moves is not a bad thing at all. Yeah. I heal my bros. Heal your mons. Speed and through. I don't think it's actually active. If it's not. Um, I'm still gonna go through here and fight trainers and get a specific TM. Um, that used to be Dig. Yeah. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Talk to these guys. Oh, right. Flexing the uh, printer. Swimmer Pansy. Which that one is, uh, I believe, is That's this. That's Picnic Lights. Yeah. I remember it right. And I'm gonna go talk to this lady. She's thinking like a teacher. And she gave me a quick claw because I am, quote, working hard. And he's not just hardly working. Uh, 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 uh. And I'm going to see what I have that has the lowest speed. Boomer humor. I get it. 37, 44, 22, 38, 38. Jiggles Puff it is. You look at. <laughs> You've never heard him call her 
Jiggles puffs at you. Uh, what exactly is a spuff, and why are you jiggling it? <laughs> oh no! What I'm gonna do? I was gonna say I would. Give I'm gonna give it the miracle seed. Don't jiggle my spuff. Jiggles puff. The S is on Jiggles. No. Ian, 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 I understand. <laughs> I was, I was doing things for the humor. Hey, Rusty. He was saying the funny words. The, the, the word spuff sounds funny and vaguely inappropriate. And so I wanted to play on that as I told a joke for our audience. Rusty. That was the thing. Rusty, I'm going to please ask you to stop right now. I don't know if I can handle it. <laughs> Talk to this lady. She got mail from her daughter. He cheered her up. Oh, and what's so this? we were talking about how uh, cut will cut the grass. If you cut the tall grass, it will turn into short grass, and then you can cut it again. Mm -hmm. Did you know that? That sounds made up. Paralyzed heal. Here, going, going, yeah, going, going, and God, I don't remember it being this long. Oh, what's this? No, it's it's a, a technical minute. machine. TM twenty eight. TM twenty eight is mirror, mirror coat. coat. Cool move. Don't think I'm gonna use it. I don't know. It'll probably get pretty good usage spread because uh, it is an interesting prospect for Merp. I don't think it's a very safe prospect. It's a risky it's a risky gambit, but it would pay off the one time it worked. <laughs> yeah. No. Well, Diggs got a pretty good spread. So. Off the top of my head, Flumph and Merp can use it. Um, you did give me an idea, though, Rusty. Um, I don't want to go into the grass yet, because I want to save my encounter for the Nat National Park uh, for the bug-catching contest, which uh -huh. we'll probably do next week. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go in here. I might look first, just to see. Yeah, I, I've already checked. Okay. Uh, it's Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Well, it's going to say, who can know cut, but... Oh, Okay, let's so you're gonna cut your way to the uh, trainers for yes. training. Let's take a look just to make sure. Yeah. Yep. And I'm gonna deposit. Let's say. Uh, Draw the epic return of Marsh. Epic. All right. Um, so we're gonna make use of a mechanic that doesn't get a whole lot of feature. Um, I'm gonna go over here and have Marsh use cut. Had a cool little animation there and everything. A lot of people didn't know that. Because I'm not sure they even say it's a thing. I'm not sure if there's like a yeah. trainer tip sign or... or there may there be was, an see. There was a tiny one-sentence blurb about it in the uh, little handbook that came with the cartridge. Probably. That sounds about right. Oh, there was. This manky had a berry. Oh. Alexis. It's okay. Oh, what's the... Oh, lazy Mike. What's the, the scary stat they always say? You know, statistically, you're never, like, 
further than like 10 feet away from a spider or something. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna have... Statistically, you've already eaten a spider today. Thanks. Thanks, Rusty. Oh, that's You are not in the right menu. Menu is hard. Men menu is hard. I get it. The Pokemon world is deep. And there are certainly many things I don't know. You know, it's good to admit that you don't know. That's right, Swimmer Male Jonathan. Dilber. Again, someone we've seen a couple of times now. Yep. We haven't stabbed it with the horn yet. I don't believe we have. So that's the real adventure. Was it? Oh, for me? <laughs> Ian? Yeah. If somebody came up to you and said, here is a present and it exploded in your face, what would you do? Um, probably scream in agony. That sounds appropriate. I don't think I should have used the uh, fire horse for this. No, maybe not. Back to Betty White it is. Don't worry. Betty White will save it. Like everything. She will, she will also resist this water drop. As soon as we get to equity, Betty White's going to start getting real good. We don't get surf in equity. We do. We get surf over... Uh... No, no, we do. We get it in the... Uh... The dancers. Yep. Never mind. Took me a minute to uh, remember how this game worked. I will never forgive your transgressions. Yeah, that's alright. Isn't the grass here, like, generally in the shape of a Pokeball? Yeah, kind of. The right. fountain is the little button in the middle. Yeah. All these squirrels are making a circle. Oh, oh, Rusty, you're right. No, when you're right, you're right. Yup. I believe uh, in my youth, I also learned that it changed the spawn rates. The spawn rates are different in the short and tall grass um, and not the location in the field, but in the short or tall grass. Yeah. This is brave. I don't think he knows what I'm with. If it does, it's bubble. In before you get hit with crab hammer. I... Normally, this is a Raichu and is actually still a pretty dangerous match. On the uh, heels of me being so, so correct yeah. about the grass... Yeah. Uh, I am going to uh, step out and uh, grab myself something to drink. Okay. I will be right back. You take that victory drink. You should. You're worth it. Just like Royale. Yep. So do you think that Kingdom is just like, uh, step on me? No. I don't think it is at all. And I hate that you said it. I hate that you thought it. I hate that, that it's a thing. I hate that we're talking about it. And I just hate it. Okay, just check it. That's not what I want to do. We're going down. Down. Let's go down, down, baby, baby, down. Yeah, I'm sure that's, that's how that works. No, that's the lyric. Yeah. On the music sheet, it's just... <laughs> I hate it. Draw. <laughs> That's a word. No more sex.
Where? What? Who? Who's still in the box for? Mark? Barbara. Okay. The I was just healing. Uh, oh. Little oh. Okay. Sam Betty White again. I'm glad you're enjoying yourself. It's a good thought. It is a good thought. What do you think your signature move would be? Hmm. It wouldn't be the Kamehameha. Ian, if she goes Super Sam, she is a literal golden girl. Yeah. If Betty White goes Super Saiyan. She's a literal golden girl. Rusty, a literal golden girl. <laughs> I like having a go home button. It's certainly indicative of the nature of our stream that you have a dedicated <laughs> go home button. <laughs> Rusty. A literal golden girl. <laughs> I didn't even think of it. Her signature move is Kamehame Hot in Cleveland. <laughs> Oh, fuck you. <laughs> I'm really reaching for that deep Betty White lore, too. What? One, how dare you? Two, what gives you the right? Uh, we went from six viewers to three viewers there. <laughs> it was worth it. You know, if, if they can't handle me and my Betty, then they don't deserve me. If I oh, I was taking a drink. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, yes. Oh, it's an ice bear. One or more of these numbers isn't right. It says we got three viewers, but I can view the users in chat, and there's at least four, plus a moderator and me. There is, there is a moderator. I am. I, yes, I, it I is you. But there's four users that aren't either of us. Yeah. And but our stats say that there's just three viewers. I don't know what our actual metrics are. What's up with that? Okay. It, it looks like Dan did leave though. Uh, I miss him. I think what it is is the users in chat show who has been there. Somewhat. Who who has communicated? No, yeah. that's not even right either. I don't know. Twitch broke. Yeah. Twitch machine broke. <laughs> Understandable. This psychic sure of using water types. Also, he's a gymnast. 
the uh, can you kiss from a rose. Yeah. It's a good song. Y'all. It is a good song. And it's just gonna be what I think of every time. I wish it would actually hit itself. That'd make my day. But it's not. No, it's not. See, you know, that seal is not controlled by me. Because, uh, it's getting good luck. And I don't have that when I play Pokemon. Mm-hmm. You want to talk play... about luck. So, we're gonna reap the fruits of our effort. Because I'm using Barbara. And I'm gonna use that grass. Oh, move. he's gonna heck up this. It's quad super effective. Poor old boy. Bonk. So, I was playing uh, Shield, starting my playthrough. Yep. And on the first round, you can catch something. Yep. It took me three balls to catch it. Yep. It was in red, you know. Literally couldn't have heard it more. Didn't have a way to uh, uh, give it a status effect. Yeah. Literally the best I could do. Could not get the uh, numbers any anymore. And it broke from a ball twice. It was a level three. Level three Rookadines. And still could not catch it. It took me three balls to catch it. Not only could you not catch it, you couldn't catch a break. Um, I am not going into the grass here because I'm saving my encounter for the suit of Last night, I had a 90% accuracy move miss three times in a row. And then I lost that Pokemon to an errant crit. Yeah. And then I lost my next Pokemon to an errant crit. Oh. Was the 90% accuracy move Leaf Storm? It is not a move that you are aware of, Nathan. Ah. You know, normally this fight wouldn't be a problem, Nate. It's still not a problem. I'm great at this game. Actually, so. Ian, remind me to show you this move. Because I want to show you the animation on it. Um... Okay. I'll know which one you're talking about when you guys come in on uh, uh, Sunday. Just be like, show me the move, and I'll be hey, like, Nate. okay, not know which one. Talking. Hey, Nate. Yeah. What did, you, what did you just say? I'm good at this game, which is why I had the foresight to swap into something that was safe. I understand. What did you say before that? What was the okay. literal step? You're getting on to me. For getting bad confuse hacks. I was talking about the sentence before that. Yeah. What did you say? I don't get this game. No, before that. I'm not worried about it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I gotta do is zoom and zoom and zoom and then zoom. It's not how computers work. And I'm gonna deposit. Then I'm gonna withdraw. Did it die? No. Okay. I'm just healing it. Oh, okay. But gotcha. he was fighting a Venomoth, and it, and the Venomoth kind of hacked him up a little bit because you know it doesn't know Ember. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. Because <laughs> you made it forget it. Alright. Go over here. And go. Zoop. Hey, Floria. It wiggled. He got all wiggly. Didn't like it. Oh, we got a quiz we gotta do. A quiz? For what? Mm hmm. Well, we need a water can. And we can't get a water can without beating Whitney. Yeah. And Whitney's not in the gym. We already did the quiz. Yeah. Oh, we did? Yeah. 
Yeah. Right. We did it very last thing last week, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, you have to get the radio card. Yeah. Um, and I think you only have to do that to unlock Whitney in Gen 4, because I don't think she was there. Um, oh, really? Is... You can just totally skip the radio card? Yes, which means that when you get to the segment where you do need the radio card in Kanto, you have to drag your ass all the way back to Golden Rod. There is literally a bullet train that gets you to Golden Rod. Yeah. But... Still at home. Yeah. All right. Hey, I think it might be gym time. It is gym time. Okay, so... Last chance to place your bets on what that mill tank's going to be. I bet mill tank. Yeah, Rusty is betting mill tank. So, chat. So, we have randomized what the encounter is. So, technically, can still I mean, be mill tank. But... So, it can. It can actually technically randomize into the same thing, right? Yes. We've seen a couple of it doesn't, of that. It doesn't force it to do something different. No, Not it to my knowledge. Okay. So, okay. the um, the thing that will be it is it'll, it'll be a similar strength to the mill tank, probably fairly close in base stat total is what we think it is. Yeah. So, kind of think of things that are close to mill tank. Um, off the top of my head, pincer sounds about right. Um, I'm gonna guess Tauros. Tauros is literally the same if I remember correctly. But I, that's Since what I'm Tauros eggs can hatch from a mill tank. And just because I kind of want that to, to happen, I think also, it's Tauros. Also, we argued fighting a normal type in the normal type chain. Yeah, that's because normal types are very common and, again, similar levels. Similar levels this great. might actually just be the same Jigglypuff. Very well could be. Yeah, maybe. So, I'm sure everybody knows, or it, it's a fa it's fairly common knowledge now. I did not know until the Gen 4 remakes, though, the uh, walls that are in here, if you look at them from an aerial view, um, make the shape yeah, of the... It's a buff. It's a Clefairy. You're a Clefairy. Thanks, bro. Got him. Oh, scribe Nia. Gotta have blue hair. What is that even? I might need to step out here for just a second again. I've me. got some people coming home. Okay. Yeah, make sure everything's good okay. over there. I'll be back in just a minute. All right. Good luck. Somehow we'll have to carry the stream. Oh. You know what I need to do? What? There we go. Should all be updated now. Now we're cooking the gas. There we go. Subscribe. An iggly buff. Iggly buff. Oh, I'm gonna you. step on it. Oh, okay. Oh, it's all iggly and buffy and getting stepped on. Yep. Grip probably mattered then. Probably. You gonna stay in? No. no. You go into Jigglypuff? No. No. I would have. No, I'm not you. That's true. Instead, I'm gonna flump it up. Flump. Hit it right in the flump! Bonk. Hit it with the flump? I guess. Yeah. It's kind of the way that should actually go. Bonk. 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 No. It can't be. Ah! Should actually no tackle. Probably. Should no fight. No, I don't think that's fine. Mm -hmm. What it does know is get critical hit by Flump. Nice! Critically hit. That's how we flump it up. Flump it up. Flump, 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 flump it up. And... Get 
go over here and try and fight some more trainers. Some more trainers. So more. what is the ideal Pokemon that is the mill tank? Something ground or water type, right? That wouldn't be horrible. Um, something poison type we could kill easy. That'd be nice. I'm trying to think of a sun kern. Yeah, or a sun flora. Sand attack. Oh god, pocket sand. My one weakness. Sand attack. Um, something fighting would be bad. I mean, hardening could take it out, but that's literally half of our team that wants weak to it. So, like, if it's a Hitmon, it's not a good for us. Yeah. Neuter this thing just a little bit. Yeah, I can tell. Boom! Oh. Bonesaw is ready. And the tail whip. Bone Club is ready. Hey, let me my berry. And tackle it. Tackle! That didn't do it. He keeps on missing, huh? Yeah, I hit it with a lot of uh, sand attacks. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hi, I'm back. Welcome back. Yeah. Um, I am gonna go and grind just a little bit. I'm expecting a level 20 something equivalent to a mill tank, and that can be a lot of really bad things. I think 23. Yeah. And I also have another trainer. Fight, so I'm gonna do that first. We can verify. I am literally working on it. The mill tank is level twenty. I know that. Oh yeah, you're right. It's just level twenty. Um, so yeah. I'm going to at eighteen or twenty. In silver, it's nineteen. They did try to make it a little little easier. Or in silver, it's also level 58. Either way, I'm gonna give the demon cow some a little extra room. This one. Oh, poet Mia. In black and white, it knows hammer arm and zen headbutt. Yeah, that's right. Or Pokemon. brick break and zen headbutt. In Pokemon Stadium, it knows earthquake. Um, by Ian, I think you mean Pokemon Stadium Two. Yes. yes. She also has a gloom for some reason. In the console games are weird. When you fight her again, she's got a her build tank that knows earthquake as well, and reversal also has a Golduck, a Persian, a Dawn fan, a Mr. Mime, and a Tauros. And it's Iron. I doesn't afraid of the smear though. I'm gonna use tail. Tail wheel. Whip tail. Ah, yes. It is now sketch tail wheel. I'm gonna step on it. Stop that. 
Well, Moss is gonna grow up. Oh, put with Mia. You and your defeat. Alright. I'm gonna go have me a little bit of grind. Do you a grind? I'll go grind. For that. Fresh to death EXP. about as good a place as ever. Mm okay. That oh, would be cool. We got a bunch of Could've, but we did. I don't know. What, what level are you going for? Uh, 23. Sounds good. Hopefully. Hopefully. Well, I've been, uh, numbering it by that time. I hope so. Damn, Evie decides that he wants to love you finally. One can only hope. Is paralyzed. Yeah. Okay. Take care of that. Don't deposit it. Why not? Because that makes it sad. It doesn't make it sad. It's just it doesn't grow. But I will. Still farm that love by walking. Past the entrance a bunch of times. Hey, all of it's more affection. Well, friendship. I loved how pissed off it looks. It does just look so angry. You can legitimately get Ditto there. And barrage you there pretty good. Yeah. I'm actually going to have to be a little bit careful. Come on, Rock Throw. Um, I guess that's super effective. Yes, but it's not very uh, perfectly accurate. The only grass move it knows is Leech Seed, but I'm not willing to um, risk my Murph on that. Back. I know it's Pokemon, so that just happens, but you're the eighth kid this week. Just walk into my house randomly. Like a goddamn even. So bad. 
It took so long. The worst part is he had to split up like between four Pokemon, so they got like two EXP apiece. I've been in. I would just run, man. I don't think it's worth it. But if I run, it wins. The other thing is, um... You, ha you do have potions. Yeah. I also have going in here. Somebody might look up friendship mechanics to verify that, but I don't think depositing it lowers friendship. Two. Generation 2, friendship was expanded to cover all Pokemon. All Pokemon have a base friendship of 70. Any Pokemon caught on a friend ball start with a uh, 200 friendship, and any po Pokemon had from an egg starts with 120 friendship. Um, in Gold, Silver, and Crystal, an NPC will evaluate the friendship of the first Pokemon in the party can be found in Goldenrod City. Uh, Met the Blisters. It sure doesn't say that anything. Uh, fainting drops it by one. The only things that seem to drop it are fainting. Are fainting. Using energy powder or heal powder, the energy root of the re revival are. And those would seem to be the only things that subtract it. It's really hard to lower friendship. Yeah. Using vitamins Raise is a them. great yeah. way. Um, leveling up is also pretty good. It actually gets more uh, more affection. So, like, if you caught it on Route 12 and you grind on Route 12, apparently it gets a uh, it gets it faster. Interesting. You could also just walk 130,560 steps. You know, I feel like I'm getting close. Walking 512 steps gives it plus one to the whole party. Yeah, I just multiplied that by 255 to get to max friendship. You so. shouldn't need to go to max. Max friendship seems to be 255. It's broken up from 0 to 99, 99 to 199, and 200 to 250. So 255 is a data structure number. Yeah, so that's kind of how the bell curve works. So you tend to get more for the 0 to 99, less as it goes on. So apparently battling gym leaders, the elite four members, champion or red, uh, gives you more Come on. 
using a battle item like the X attack, X defend, X special, X speed also gives it. Grooming gives it plus three until you get to 200, and then it gets extra plus one. Yeah, using vitamins is really good. Same, same curve as leveling up. Nice. Man. They just heck you up, don't they? I'm getting better at that. So, if your opponent is less than 30 levels higher than you, you only get a minus one if you faint. But if they're above 30 levels, or they faint outside of battle, like poison, they get a minus five or a minus ten, depending on how high their friendship is. Minus ten is if they're above 200. Thunder. One of you guys might look and see if anything on my team learns anything at level 20, between now and level 23, just in anticipation of me having to catch something. Okay. What are you checking first? I'm checking Jigglypuff. I'll check Ponita. Uh, the Pokemon's name is Ponyta. I do call it. I'm gonna check Ponita. It gets fire spin at 26. I'll keep an eye out for that. Whoops. Uh, double slap at 24. I'll keep an eye out for that. I'm taking I'm going Murphy. I'm gonna next. check. Yeah, I'm gonna check the right side. You check the left side on the, uh, we'll preview. Tracker. That wasn't planned, but okay. But that works out. Uh, Butterfree gets Whirlwind at 23. Gust at that. 28. Um... um. I'm going to check Eevee and uh, Umbreon. Onyx gets Harden at 23. Keep an eye out for that. Eevee gets Swift at 21 and Takedown at 24. Eevee does not get Swift at 21 because he doesn't have Swift. Make sure you're looking at uh, Gen 2. Yeah, I... I clicked on Gen 2. Okay. Okay. It just didn't register the click. Uh, he gets uh, Quick Attack at 23. That's not horrible. Uh, and very careful here. Umbreon. Gardening did not learn world. Good job, proud of you. Umbreon also gets a uh, quick attack at 23. Um, we missed Pursuit. He will, on, on your Goldeen, he will learn Flail at 24. I don't particularly care. That's what's gonna happen. But yes, thank you for that. Ooh, a smoochum. Smoochum. We hadn't seen a smoochum. That was probably a, uh, Yanma. Possible. Um, 
I believe Yanma is... We saw one thing that was really weird. Ammonite. That's it. I've only seen ah. one Ammonite so far. Um, because it has a 1% chance unless it's swarming. Yeah. Okay. How long does gold mean level up? Or vault? Just level up, right? It should be. We should be. Low 30s, if I remember correctly. Yeah, we're getting kind of close. Yeah, 33. It's a little high. Mm, just kind of looking at seeing if things... Seeking is not anything stellar. No. Um, if Barbara gets double slap at level 24, I may just always, might as well go for that extra level. Yeah. I want to make it better. Um, Rabidash is really late. I'm yeah, like Rabidash 42. 40. So are we going to try to do this uh, gym battle before the end of uh, the stream? Like last thing? Time. Be a good... I believe we do. If not, we can fudge the numbers there a little bit. Well, we got 23 minutes. Yeah, I'm I'm not expecting it to take much longer. Okay. Get rid of that paralyzed. I love that name. It's a good name. Dan, I know you're probably not here right now, but... You may go watch the bot after him. It's a good name. He did good. Dan he told good. me Benedict was a good name. Benedict is a good well, name. Well, you see, Rusty, his name was better than yours. That you're gonna be... See, Rusty, that's wrong. <laughs> I like that that little banter we do at the beginning of every stream. Yeah, it, it is where a bit you of a, ask couch us a question, and you tell, and we tell you the wrong thing. Yeah, no, it, it, it's a couch gag is never a bad thing. Yet. That's the same, I guess. He's kicking me. No, I get it. Okay. So, Nathan. Yeah? You're uh, walking through uh, the outskirts of town. You walk through some tall grass. Yeah. And a pile of pink goo kind of oozes up in front of you. Yeah. Uh, and as you approach it to investigate it, yeah. it turns into what appears to be you. Yeah. What do you do? Uh, there is an XKCD comic. Uh, that uh, approaches uh, this particular problem. Um, specifically, uh, Mr. Randall Monroe uh, says that a clone of you showing up could be a sign of universal instability, and therefore it could disappear at any time. Um, and therefore you will never have a, have another opportunity to make out with yourself. So you should do with that time what you will. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say it was. Did you say it was Dagnerus? Yeah, it was. Like, dangerous, but... Wrong and bad? <laughs> yes, he did. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I know words good. Unlike menus. Can I get a menu in Tark? 
you know, I could do a stream like this with people who like me and are nice to me. <laughs> are you sure you could? No, I don't think I could. I like you, Flumpf. I like you too. Flumpf is trying to learn quick attack. Which is better than tackle right now. Yes. Because tackle's 35 base power. It is. So I believe if you attack. evolve right now, you get to learn quick attack again. No. I would have the opportunity to. If he knows it already, though, it won't happen. Yeah. You oh, cannot okay. learn the same move twice. You would also notice he has not evolved yet. He's not better about it. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Ooh, unfortunate. A crew? Not quite. done murked him. Murk is trying to learn hard. I don't think I want to learn hard. Though. I was going to say. Stop yeah. learning? There you go. I did you didn't hard. overwrite your stab move. Proud of you. And I'm going to do one more level on Barbara just, just because the double, double slap, slap might be a useful stab move. Mm -hmm. Some sudden did that. Oh. Also, remind me to go heal at an actual Pokemon Center before I go fight with me. Hey, Nate. Yeah? Before you fight with me. Yeah? Hear me out. Yeah? Go heal at an actual Pokemon Center. You know, that's a great idea, Ian. I should have thought of that. Glad I did. I got you. Hey, Ian. Hey, uh, Rusty? Uh, I got an idea. Yeah? Uh-huh. Uh, Nathan should heal at a Pokemon Center before we go fight the actual gym. Hey, Rusty. That is a fantastic yeah. idea, and I'm glad you had it. Yeah, with friends like I'm these. here to help the stream. We really thank you for it. All right. I'm going to divvy up some berries. Give one to Merp. Merp. Give one to... I no, would just give one to everybody that doesn't have a thing. Well, as a matter of fact, Ian, I was planning on that. Well, I didn't know if you would, were going to like think about doing a poison cure or whatever. Hey. 10 HP is a lot at this point. Yeah. That's it. Solid. You know... Fourth of your health. Pretty close to it, anyway. Nathan, you did a good job of remembering. Thank you. Like Rusty told you to. And why not lead off with little Knox? So, uh, what's the amount of music you can play before you get a uh, copyright? I think it's 30 seconds. <laughs> Asking for a friend. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Let's see what Whitney's name becomes. And what her cow becomes. I'm telling you, it's Taurus. Which might still be a little scared. Hi, I'm Whitney. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. That is the 90s. Yeah, it's very, very Pokemon old man. are super cute. You want a battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. Get into it, and our Pokemon are super cute. It is very 90s. Hi, good, I'm Dad. 
<laughs> Sailor Mia. Mia. Pidgeotto. That's a uh, normal type. It is, it is. As a matter of fact, it turns into Pidgeotto at level 18, so it's even a legal Pidgeotto. I'm gonna stomp it. Is that a uh, shot? Nino Burrito. I'm gonna stomp on this bird. Yep. <laughs> I will stomp you with my hooves. <laughs> I think there's a shot across the bow at uh, Faulkner. At Faulkner there. Hey, look at this. You know, they say you can clip a bird's wings with a little jolt of your hooves. <laughs> Sailor Mia is about to use Lantern. Lantern? That's not even close to a mill tank. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think it is. Um... I do have a contingency for this situation, though. Are you gonna... Are you gonna do it? You gonna vine with it? He's gonna whip it! Well, whip first, it real good! First he's gonna... Say, I'm gonna say two. I need, uh... I need you to deliver some lantern milk for me. <laughs> Don't you confuse me. Come on, go to sleep. Uh, Nate? Yeah. I don't know if that's, uh, working well for you. It yeah, doesn't seem to be. Garbage. Absolute <laughs> garbage. Adam <laughs> right. Patricia needs. Well, this is actually good because yep. you're having Flump participate in the gym battle, which gives it extra uh, affection. So, it's a good call. I like it. So, it'll know what is it? God! Yeah, it sure is being annoying. We, we know that it knows Thunder Wave. Yeah. It does not know an electric move. If that piques your interest other than uh, Thunder Wave. You should know Thunder Wave, Supersonic, Flail, Water Gun. Well, geez, I think if you had just double slapped it from the beginning, we would have been done here. Well, that did more damage uh, because I tail lifted with Flump. Ah, okay. But yes, I probably should have just straight gone into attack. Uh, that's also why I used Double Slap instead of Vine Whip because I loaded his defense. And Vine Whip is a special move in this generation. But we did it. That yeah. seems still easier than a mill tank. Yes, it does. Really, the problem is the combination of bulk and rollout in the early game is just such a devastating combo. It and is it's difficult. Um, and it's that said, I wouldn't have worried a whole lot against an actual mill tank because I have murdered. Right. I'm gonna go talk to friend here. Oh no, you made Whitney cry. It's okay, she'll stop soon. She always cries when she loses. So when I was a youngin, I thought you had to walk out of the gym completely, then walk back. Yeah. This is better. It is. I received TM45. Normally that's a track which has great distribution. So, uh... Oh. Kinesis. That's a, not a good move. I was going to say, it's real bad. So hopefully it's a fire move. But no, it's not. It's fine. I can lower something's accuracy. Yay. Okay, well, that's not bad. Uh, up next, I'm going to go get a squirt ball. So we still have ten minutes, so yeah. let's go... Uh, See if we can't figure out a catch. Yeah, hey, yeah we have time to catch a a, a, a stony tree. I'm saying, I'll probably not set a wudo. We have to ca time to catch. I also wanted to see if I could find that NPC that tells me uh, French. Let 
me pull it back up. Uh, judge my flow. You sure so heal? Yeah, that's good. Idea. Do you really trust me? What does that mean? I am pulling it back up. It, did it say it really trusts you? Yes. It's between 200 and 249. Okay. And at 250, I think, is the last bracket where it will begin to evolve. Cool. So you are almost there. Sounds like I'm well on my way. But again, it did get to uh, compete in the... So can you guys hear that? Yes. What? Yes, I can. It sounds like okay. the fire alarm's going off. It is. Your smoke detector. I'll be right back. Yes, make sure your oh, house doesn't turn out. I think I think we're good. <laughs> All right. So I think I in this game, which is what they did in Gen Four, I actually have to go to Pseudo Wudo to get the squirt bottle. No, I believe that you have to get it from the flower shop, which is by the gym. Talk to this girl. And talk to the girl at the flower shop. Are you sure? I am positive I do. Maybe just go down there. I don't have cut. Oh, no, that's right. You may have to go back and forth. It's possible. Squirt bottle. Squirt. And I'm gonna put hardening up front. I always thought that it was Squirtle bottle. Well, in Gen 4, it is uh, a Squirtle. Starting in Gen 3 with the Whalmer Pale, uh, the bottles always have some sort of motif. Some sort of yes. So logic. if you use it in Gen 4, it is a, actually a little like Squirtle. Squirtle Squirt. Okay. What is it? It's a weird tree. Oh, should have gone in that box. Oh well. Oh well. It's a Larvitar! Oh, gotta go. oh neat. Yes. I am also going to swap very quickly. Yeah, I can imagine why. I don't think it knows a rock move yet, but I'm not willing to bet my Butterfree on that. In fact, we can check. What I am going to do is put it to bed. Put it to sleep! Chat, be thinking of a name for a Larvitar. This one is male. Oh, I'm gonna slap it. Not very effective. Yeah. Name that tar. If this were Gen 7, it would learn. It would have no rock slide already, but it doesn't. It knows fight, leer, sandstorm, and screech. The learn rock slide at level 22. You managed to catch it. I sure hope I catch it. Um, I am going to swap to Flump. Quick second. Are you going to swap Merp out for this Larvitar? Probably not. I want it to go to sleep. So I'll probably just stay with Barbara. Get Nathan, he's talking about if you catch it, will you face no, Merp? No, not Merp. But if Merp dies, I know what's going on my team. Um, 
Though I will say, I have actually beaten a Gen 2 game with the Tyranitar before, so... I'm not exactly chomping at the bit to use it, um, but it's still a really cool catch. It is kind of cool. Yeah, Tyranitar is really good. Tyranitar is very good. Tito. I've done a, I think it was a Pokemon Gold randomizer where I've used a Tyranitar. I loved it, it was great. I think I got it as a Pupitar. Pupitar. Alright. Yeah. Let's see if we can get you. That's the question. Do you want to switch to Mo? No, because I don't want to waste, waste any yeah. sleep turns. Yeah, I get you. Ian, I'm sending you a link. Don't open it in front of Nathan. Ooh, that's spicy. Now, Rusty, what if I opened it behind Nathan? I mean, you can go for it. Think of all the prepositions you can open it in relation to me. Hey, Rusty. What if What if I opened it within Nathan? <laughs> Ugh. You can also see that uh, Jigglypuffs are kind of... Uh, the Jigglypuff line is kind of aimed uh, around HP, because you'll notice that most of my people around mid-50s, 60s, Jigglypuff has 95, 95 HP. Yeah, he's got a third more. He is beefy. Half again. To sleep. Purposely. He's a, a thick, beefy boy. <laughs> All of, you think you think he's a balloon? Nah, that's all flesh. <laughs> well, that's a yeah. Ah. That's super interesting, huh? Yeah, yeah. that's that's real, real okay. fun. We'll talk about it later. Yeah. Like in two months. <laughs> okay. Here's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna go to Betting Light. I mean, if we get one on stream, we'll talk about it right then. Yeah. And knowing Nathan's luck. I've been known to uh, be up all night in the sun. You up all night? Till the sun? Yeah, whatever that lyric is. Are you up all night for good fun? Sometimes. Are you up all night to get lucky? He's up all night for don't, don't mind. He definitely has stayed up all night playing Pokemon. That is 100% a thing that has happened. I don't know what y'all are talking about. The F to sleep. Please. No. You just don't wanna. Go to bed. He's feisty. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. It's like, I was gonna say, it's the <laughs> Iron Man and the Hulk Bust Armor just punching him over and over. <laughs> go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. <laughs> Alright. You guys are similar. Get in the ball. I love that our name is to Jim. Damn it. Get in the ball. What is the lure You're ball? You're going to end up catching it in that lure ball. Possible. Lure ball... Uh, has a greater chance of catching things that are on a fishing rod. Ah, I see. Yes. Get in the ball. Oh, you know what? What? His catch rate is based on Mount Silver and what you, what technology you have available That's then. That's why I said I needed to go get balls. I should have gone and got bells. Oh, well. Get in the ball. 
Yeah, I don't. Something, something, something. I don't know if it'll happen, Nate. Possible won't. I'd be kind of disappointed, but not surprised. I'm kind of disappointed too. We still need balls. Yep. We have five more shots. Yep. And a lure ball is equal to a pokeball if it doesn't have any boost to it. Oh. Yep. Thought. Oh shoot! It was so close too. <laughs> it was. The other annoying thing is I'm gonna have to get. Sandstorm's real. Well. This says the guy that. Is known to run sandstorm teams. Yeah. That's why I run them. It's real annoying. Let's <laughs> go in my bag. Go in my Pokeball. I want to cram this thing into it. Nebby, get in the ball. In the wall. Give the tar. Give tar. There we ah! go. Oh, Nathan. Good shit. Yeah. Yo, know, I was just thinking. Yeah. I believe. Uh, oh, no, never mind. Born deep underground, this was... Pokemon becomes a pupa after eating enough dirt to make a mountain. I was gonna say that I believe we uh, have the technology to put this Lavatar into um, Sword and Shield. No. Um, but because this is a totally 100% legitimate normal uh, Game Boy. Yeah. So, what do I name it? I don't know if we have any active chat participants, so why don't you guys think of something? We've got a couple viewers. Let's see. Um... Um... Honestly, this is the hardest part of the game for me. Yep. So I'm not doing it. I'm playing the game. <laughs> yeah. It's a boy larvitar. See, I've been intentionally trying to stay away from like gender. You guys have so many balls to think of a name. I think we were enthralled. Yeah. <laughs> In ball. That's its name. We're gonna forget what that means in a little Larry, while. Larry, Larry okay. Vitar. I don't have enough room for that. I can just name it Larry. That's good enough. His name is Larry. That'll be his name. Larry. All right. Uh, I'm gonna do one last thing on the stream here. Actually, two. Uh, first of all, I'm going to talk to this guy. Did you clear that wretched tree? I'm impressed. I want you to have this. To Jim, receive TM08. Is he not the Rock Smash guy? He is the Rock Smash guy. Oh. Rock Smash is the TM in this, Jim. Vital throw? That's do, pretty cool. Do we need Rock Smash? You don't need it. Okay. I was a little concerned for a second. All right. Let's see what comes out. It's up there. Uh, Murp's gonna get it. I was gonna it. say, Murp's... Are we gonna be throwing stuff with Murp? Just Murp. Alright. I'm 
I'm gonna do it to you real quick. I'm gonna take my berries. My berries. That's the thing. Make sure whomever is the slowest. Wipe that quick claw back. I'm gonna do one last thing while I'm on stream. Sorry for holding this over, guys. So I'm gonna actually go back here, go into the mart, and buy some more balls. And let's just get ten. That ought to get us through the next catch. Okay. I'll go buy a couple more. All right. And with that. We have uh, beaten a gym leader and caught Natar and just all together been very uh, productive today. Yep. Um, so if you guys wouldn't mind joining us on Sunday, Sunday, we should be continuing the blind Sunday. Nuzlocke of Pokemon Sword. Uh, we are literally at the edge of the wild area. About to learn what Dynamax is, I still don't know. So, <laughs> I think I'm gonna learn that the gimmick behind this generation is, it's gonna be a good time. Um, so, please join us 6, no, no, uh, 2 p.m. on Sunday, 2 p.m. Central Time, uh, through 6 p.m., and uh, it's gonna be a good time. Alright. Anybody else have anything to say? Um, trans lives matter. Bye-bye! Bye. Bye.